They are heroes every day. Garden Grove Police and Orange County Fire Authority firefighters racing to battle the dangers the rest of us run from. A job COVID-19 made even more life-threatening. They've done so much for us on the front lines and risking their lives and their bravery and their strength. It was an inspiration for us to give back to them. But the pandemic has produced everyday heroes like Drew Dizon, general manager of Nova Kitchen and Bar. It was extremely important for us to give back to the community. Providing meals for our first responders, the people of Nova are among many in our city who have stepped up, helped out, and fought back against the pandemic, making Garden Grove strong by strengthening those on the front lines who appreciate the help. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I can tell you that we're working very busy during this pandemic, so it's very nice to have one of our businesses in our community present these lunches to our employees. How can I help? What can I do? Questions asked over and over as our city came together to make Garden Grove strong, battling an invisible enemy we'd never seen before. People did whatever they could to help meet the needs of everyone, and everyone needs to eat. We want to do something because yeah. we know that's important. This harm to the COVID-19 and we need to share. Yeah. Nag Soon's restaurant's Project Trion made sure the city's essential workers were taken care of by delivering free meals for police, fire, and public works, and those city workers behind the scenes. Thank you. As terrible and as disruptive as this whole virus thing has been, the silver lining is things like this, right? It's all the private acts of generosity. I think it's a very thing to do with everything that's going on now. Everything helps. So here's two. And here's two more. You hold them. Thank you. Have a good day. Carolina's Italian restaurant was helping everyone by donating 750 free meals, including a bottle of water, to anyone who came by. There is a lot of people out there that want to help. There's a lot of people that want to do good. And I hope this is just the beginning of many businesses doing stuff like this. Thank you, guys. Thank you for your good works. That kind of generosity is contagious. We have a lot of organizations that do a lot for the community. And I think if they see this, they'll be contacting me and say, hey, we'd like to be giving out food or donating. I'd like to present these face shields to uh, Mayor Jones. The volunteers of the Garden Grove Rotary Club were among those leading the way, making and donating 500 face shields for Garden Grove Police and Public Works. When this project came up, everybody jumped on it. Being a Rotarian, this is kind of in our nature to find areas of need in the community. If there's any shining light of hope in this time frame and all these challenges we're going through, it's seeing local organizations like Rotary stepping up. School was shut down and sports canceled, but the young people of Orangewood Academy forgot their troubles and focused instead on helping others. When you start thinking, oh man, we can't have games, this and that, then you, you sit back and you realize that we probably have it better than 90, 95% of the, of the world. And at that point, I think it's about giving back to those. Partnering with Ironman Basketball, Relove Church, and OC Grace Church, Orangewood worked with Garden Grove's Buena Clinton Youth and Family Center to provide diapers, toiletries, and food for families in need. We all needed a smile during these tough times. Garden Grove Community Services provided an Easter basket full in a contact-free excavation celebration. It was great. This is such a neat experience, and getting to go on an Easter egg hunt without leaving the car. This is great. <laughs> I think given the times and all of the challenges that families have faced this past Thank year, you. this is just an awesome opportunity to be able to do something for them on this Easter holiday. It was one of a number of fun events the city hosted to provide a bit of a break in these difficult days. Thank you, Thank you, Thank you. Christ Cathedral opened up to provide vaccinations. The Nailing It event at Advanced Beauty College brought local nail salons together to offer free personal protection equipment. 
And we can't talk about heroes without bringing up the doctors, nurses, and other healthcare workers who did everything they could to care for us. They were among the many individuals, organizations, companies, and others who made such a difference to the people of our city during the pandemic. Everyday heroes, stepping up, helping out, fighting back to make Garden Grove strong. You did, and we are, and we will continue to be Garden Grove Strong.